Do you know how you will be monitored during your labor? We constantly monitor you and your baby's health to help you have a safe labor and delivery. During labor, we have multiple ways of monitoring your baby's heart rate. We select our method of monitoring based on your baby's risk factors, such as prematurity or hypertension. If your pregnancy has been low risk or uneventful, we may monitor your baby with a Doppler. Your nurse will listen to your baby's heart rate between and during contractions, usually every 15 to 30 minutes in active labor. They're making sure your baby's heart rate is between 110 and 160 beats per minute and they don't hear any decreases in the heart rate. If you have risk factors in pregnancy or any concerns about your labor progress, we may order continuous electronic monitoring. Your nurse will attach monitors to your abdomen, one designed to pick up your baby's heart rate and one to monitor contractions. Your nurse is able to monitor your baby's well-being even when he or she is not in the room. Continuous electronic monitoring doesn't always mean you're stuck in bed. We have options that make moving around possible, so please ask your nurse. If we are concerned about your labor progress or we're having difficulty tracing your baby's heart rate through your abdomen, your provider may place internal monitors. The internal monitors are placed during a vaginal exam. The fetal spiral electrode is placed through the vagina and attached to your baby's head to obtain a heart rate. The contraction monitor is called an intrauterine pressure catheter, or IUPC. This is also placed through the vagina, past your baby's head, and into your uterus. The IUPC allows us to measure the strength of contractions more accurately. These types of monitoring help us understand how your labor is going. Talk to your UC Health OB provider about any concerns you have.